So, this is a, a video to show you about the uh, triple beam balance and how to make a balance. Um, once you've tried to uh, balance it and <clears throat> bring it all the way out, and all, all the way out, and then you can go all the way in. And if it doesn't balance, okay, what you can do is you can take off all the pots and clean them and if it still doesn't balance then you're gonna have to and you can exchange the um you can change these things in the pans for other pans because we have quite a few of them um but if you if they still doesn't balance you're gonna have to take and change the uh, counterweight on this and that's what this video is uh, to show you how to do that so what you do is you come and you have this okay and this pan comes off with these three screws so you unscrew them okay uh, and what happens is uh, it's not easy to get them out and get them back in uh, the big thing I won't take it out um, but when you take it out there's all kinds of uh, weights in here it's weight a uh, weight or a counterweight is simply uh, pieces of metal and um, I have some uh, pennies he over here. There's a, some pennies. You can't see it, but okay. I have penny. Where are you? All right there. Sorry. Pennies, paper clips over here. Okay. Also have some um, shot. This is copper shot. If you want, you can go over and ask Mr. O'Connell if there's any uh, um, other type of metal shot too. And you basically put some in here into here and then you can have it upside down because because this here <clears throat> and this one here come off after you take the screws out and the, uh, and the pan off what you have is you have a well in there where you put all the uh, <clears throat> counterbalances and you put some in put this and this back into these slots put the plate on, screw it in tight, and then try it again. Okay? And you keep on doing it until your uh, scale can be uh, weighed. Okay? And you got to think about the best and the worst conditions with moving this forwards and moving it back. So you do this the least amount of time because as you can see, you will see, it takes time to <clears throat> get these things in line these holes up and get the screws in it it, it, it it's a challenge okay so <clears throat> uh, one way uh, which you can do it is since we're gonna have more than one of them you can line them kinda all up all the balances up and try to switch plates and switch these things in between the different ones <clears throat> and maybe that way you don't have to uh, go and, and and change the counterweights in here. Um, if these things don't work right and they stick, you can kind of try to push them back, um, so that they, what happens is these things uh, can be bent a little and if it, it's not going up and down freely it's because this is uh, rubbing against something so you can try to fix it that way. But <clears throat> they as many as possible need to be uh, able to be used again. Okay, and um, <clears throat> so that will be uh, one thing you are going to do. Okay, thank you. Bye.